Hango rojo korava. Sehi ya hango rojo ko. Praise your name, God. I magnify your name, God. For those of you who were on my live during my prayer time on the gram and you got chimed off, that's because that prayer was too hot for the devil. I didn't see that it was chimed off because my eyes were closed and I was in the midst of my prayer. But I chime back in to give to you what it is that the Spirit of the Lord is having me release in this hour. I heard the Spirit of the Lord say, Revelation 8. So, let's begin. When he opened the seventh seal, there was a silence in heaven for about a half an hour. And I saw the seven angels who stand before God and seven trumpets were given to them. Another angel who had a golden Caesar censer came and stood at the altar. He was given much incense to offer with the prayers of all God's people on the golden altar in front of the throne. The smoke of the incense together with the prayers of God's people went up before God from the angel's hand then the angel took the censer, filled it with fire from the altar, and hurled it on the earth. And there came pearls of thunder, rambling flashes of lightning, and an earthquake. As God gave me this verse, I saw a vision. I saw a vision right before the trumpets began to blow. Or should I say, this specific trumpet began to blow. And I saw, just as it spoke here, I saw an angel with a censer and he filled it with fire. And when the angel filled the censer with fire from the altar, he hurled it onto the earth. And I saw him hurling a censer from the altar onto the earth. And there came pearls. It was like pearls. But then these pearls were hurling from the altar. And they were hurling the altar of God, the throne of God. They were hurling from that altar. And they look like pearls, like pearls you get out of a seashell. And then they just went pearly white. And then they just psh, like fireball darts. And they became rumbling up on the earth, all over the earth. With flashings of lightning. And, and these, this lightning began to cause earthquakes everywhere. Yahanguru kovahati yende. Praise you, Father. I began to see the prayers of God's people. The prayers of all of God's people. Prayers that had yet to be answered. And these prayers went up before the heart and the nostrils of God Almighty. It was as if these pearls of thunder were clearing the entire earthly realm as if the pearls of thunder were making the earth a holy altar just be, as before God began to step forward and appear before these trumpets were blowing, before these bowls were poured out. It's like pearls of, of thunder were like, like when they roll out a red carpet, but it was pearls of fire before God stood up to step out. To begin to watch the plagues that are going to happen here upon the earth. I saw God's people praying for their family, for their friends, for their loved ones, for other saints, for strangers. They, God's people were just praying all over. And I saw this and I sensed this very deeply as a sense of a last answer of prayers before the trumpets blew before the bowls poured out and then God took me to another scripture and he was saying that the reason that all these things all these things are going to be happening 
is because the rest of mankind, and this is Revelations chapter 9, verse 20 and 21, it says the rest of mankind were not killed by these plagues. Oh, let me read it again.